Hey everyone, it's Blake Bundy here from Winning Solutions Inc. And today I will be bringing you guys another Microsoft Access Expert Template Walkthrough. I will be showing you guys where to find the template database on our website, how to download the template database demo, and how to use the demo properly. Most of our templates are not designed to be used on their own. Instead, they are designed in a way that makes it simple and smooth to integrate it into an already existing database that you have already been using. You can also build a more robust Microsoft Access database that is built around one of our templates. If you would like to create a new database that is based off of one of our templates and don't know how or do not have the time to do so, let us know and we would be happy helping you with getting the database that 100% fits your needs. With most of our templates that we offer, there's three different versions that you can purchase. A compiled runtime version, one for internal use, and one for unlimited developer use. Our, our compiled runtime version is a run as is version without the paid full version of Microsoft Access using the free Access runtime from Microsoft. It can be integrated into your existing Access application, but you would not be able to make any modifications to the forms, the reports, the modules, etc. This option is more for those of you who do not see any need to make any customizations to the template. Our internal use version allows you to use or modify the databases however you wish within your organization. And last but not least, our unlimited developer use version allows you to use the database template however you wish for any applications you develop and distribute the template as part of a database you create. Winning Solutions Inc's templates have a strong advantage over shrink wrap software that you purchase from a store or website. With our templates, you receive the source code along with your purchase so you are able to customize and update the database as you please. With the shrink wrap software, you do not receive the source code when purchasing the software, which means that you cannot update or customize the database as you wish. In our video today, we will be working on a demo version of our database template. A demo is a simple way that you can view and try out our database templates so that you can determine if you would like to purchase it or not. This is great for customers due to the fact that all of our sales are final. Our sales are final because when we, we give you the source code when you purchase the template. And once we give you the source code, there is really no way that you can return the code. If you'd like to test out our demos for multiple days, you are free to do so. All you have to do is leave the database open so that the data you enter will not be wiped. That is because our demos are designed so that once you close the demo, all the data that you have entered will be wiped from that database. You have to purchase the full version if you would like to save your data that you have entered. Upon downloading a demo for one of our templates, you will have to unzip the downloadable file. Zip files make it much easier to send and download large files over the web. Unzipping a file is a very simple step. All you have to do is extract the file so that you have access to the uncompressed file. If you do not know how or do not understand how to unzip a file, check out our YouTube channel and watch the How to Unzip One of Our Files video tutorial to learn this simple step. The link to that video will be in the description of this video. So now, let us get into downloading and testing out one of our templates. We're going to start off here by going to our website at microsoftaccessexpert.com. As you can see, I have been here before. On the top of our website, there's going to be a toolbar with all the various ways that you are able to contact Winning Solutions Inc. You're going to want to click on the sidebar button on the left side of our homepage that is labeled Database Templates for Sale. A sub list then opens up and you need to select the Database Templates List button to view the list of all of our templates that we offer. The list is broken up into categories. The different categories that we currently have are our most popular ones, appointment and scheduling databases, calendars databases, reservations and booking databases, contact and communications databases, task management databases, 
equipment and maintenance tracking databases, sales databases, employee databases, education databases, small business databases, and last but not least, database tools and miscellaneous templates. And today we're going to be taking a look at the Microsoft Access Students Database Template. So if you scroll up to our education section right here, hit the Access Student Database. Once that web page opens, go to the Download a Demonstration section and download a demo that correctly corresponds with the current version of Microsoft Access that your computer is currently running on. I'm going to download this one. Once you've downloaded the file, open the file, and the file is going to be zipped up, so you're going to need to extract all the contents of that file. Hit extract all and then hit extract. Once you've extracted that file, open the file. And with all of our database templates, since they do come from the web, your computer views it as a potential security risk or warning. Now I can assure you that this database template is safe, so I'm going to go ahead and continue on and open the file. And as always with the database templates, you also get a pop-up box just stating that this is a demo version of the database template. If you'd like to store your information that you're entering in, you need to purchase the full version. It also has all the different ways you can contact us. Feel free to contact us whenever you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and close out of this for now. So this database template is relatively simple, but it has a lot of information that you can input and a lot of details you can add. So to begin this uh, demo, we're going to hit students and we're going to add a new student. And so as you can see, you can fill out a lot of information about the student. We're just going to fill out some basic test information in order for this demo to work. So we're going to type in test and we're going to say test Smith and we're going to give them an ID one, two, three. Um, we're going to say they're in fifth grade. Um, we'll give them a date of birth. Let's see, dash three, dash seven. And as you can see, though, you can add in an address. You can click to view a map, and you can pinpoint on a map. You can add in email information, any of their contact information, and you can even add a picture of the student. You also can add guardian information, medical information, such as if they had allergies or medications they take, or their doctor's name or phone number, as well as their attendance. You can keep track of their attendance and when they miss and when they're there. So we're going to go back to this guardian information, and we're going to add a new guardian. So as you can see, the guardian details tab pops up. So we're going to make a new guardian, and we're going to say um, Bob Smith is his dad's name. And as you can see, you can fill out a lot of information here as well company, job title, email address, we'll put in a test email. Um, you can also add a picture of this guardian, their address, all their phone numbers, all that stuff. So you can add in a lot of stuff about the guardian as well. We're going to head, go ahead and hit save and new. And so now if you close out of this because we don't want to make another one, go back to here, hit save and new here. So now we uh, can create another one. We're not going to create another one for now. Go ahead and close out of that. And now if I search for that student. Oops, Test, Test Smith, he's the first one that shows up when I search for him. And I can now double click him and all of his information pops back up. And if I want to add in some more information or edit some information, I can. So I'm going to go ahead and close this for now. And so now if we go over to this Guardians tab, we can search for that Guardian we created. So if I type in Bob, there we go. As soon as I type in the B, there's that Guardian I just created, Bob Smith. As the same thing as a student, if I want to double click this, I can have this pop back up and I can add in more information about the Guardian. Close out of this one now. So it's, it's a pretty simple database, but it would be really great for a school that needed to keep track of attendance, students, and their Guardians. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to thank you guys for taking your time to watch this Microsoft Access Expert database template walkthrough brought to you by Winning Solutions Inc. I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, please feel free to like or subscribe to our YouTube channel for tons of other walkthroughs and tutorials. As always, contact us for any of your IT needs. Whether you need programming done, you want to buy a template, you want to customize a template, anything. Feel free to contact us whenever you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to post our contact information in the description below of this video. As always, you can also find us on about all social media websites. Sites. Feel free to follow us or like us on any of those we post quite frequently. Once again, thank you all for watching this Microsoft Access Expert template walkthrough and have a great day.